All right, well, we've talked about all of the safety precautions and the prohibition of fireworks here in the eastern Sierra during our first news segment. Let's talk about all the fun that is available coming up here into the weekend and next Tuesday's Independence Day celebration, including, all right, here at Sierra Wave Media, Alt 92.5, our radio station, presenting Fourth of July fun at the Village at Mammoth. Celebrate our nation's independence with an all-American picnic, fireworks, free concerts, DJs. You gotta love the ducky races and yes, the world famous Chihuahua races. All the fun starts Monday, July 3rd. Full slate of activities at the Village capping off the night with a fireworks display. Again, that's Monday night at the Village. Hey, Tuesday, July 4th, join Alt 92.5 in the Village at Mammoth for an all-American picnic. That'll be starting after the town's Independence Day Parade. Go to the village, enjoy some tasty barbecue and some live music. Alt 92.5 and Sierra Wave Media, happy to be part of the July 4th celebration at Mammoth. And I'm pleased once again to be an announcer at the Mammoth Lakes 4th of July Parade with our pal Chuck Scatolini. We'll be at our usual spot in front of Kittredge Sports. That's across from, yes, well, Mammoth Liquor and Sierra Wave Media's Rob Gill going to be right down the street in front of the Shell Station. So many great events taking place in Mammoth over the weekend, including Saturday. Hey, it's a no fishing day throughout California. Mono County, no fishing license required. Mammoth celebrates the arts in the Footloose Sports parking lot. Hey, the Sunset Freedom Bash and Summit Fireworks atop Mammoth Mountain. That should be great. July 4th, you know you got the Lions Club Pancake Breakfast in the Mammoth Mall parking lot and the Footloose Freedom Mile. You can sign up to run for that at Footloose Sports. Also, Second Chance Thrift Store. Grand opening to a new location. Pops in the Park. Felici Trio, Eastern Sierra Pops Orchestra Parade. A concert that's shortly after the parade finishes and at night the annual fireworks show at Crowley Lake and again as a reminder otherwise fireworks are prohibited. Also Independence Day and in Independence is an Inyo County premier 4th of July celebration. This year's festivities in Independence will stretch over a press release notes four fun-filled days feature performance by three local bands, two beefy barbecues, all the trimmings, dedication of Inyo County's newest railroad, a unique 4th of July parade, and of course, that rousing display of fireworks to close out the 4th of July. Fun will begin Saturday, July 1st, Town Hall Dance at the Independence Legion Hall, a musical favorite Sandy in the High Country performing on Monday, July 3rd. The Carson and Colorado Railway and the Eastern California Museum hosting the Slim Princess Engine 18. They're going to have the Silver Spike celebration. Uh, the day-long event will celebrate the recent location of the Southern Pacific Narrow Gauge Locomotive Number 18, the Slim Princess, to the Eastern California Museum grounds. Now the locomotive will be steamed up and run over the newest short line railroad in Inyo County, about 300 feet of narrow gauge demonstration track. They'll be coming out of the Larry Peckham Engine House. Monday, more music, Party in the Park, featuring the Zach Smith Band. Dahe Park, 8 p.m. until midnight. July 4th in Independence, the American Legion's flag raising ceremony at Dahe Lions Club, serving a pancake breakfast arts and craft show on the grounds of the Inyo County Courthouse. Parade starting at 10 a.m. This year's theme, hey, El Camino Sierra, U.S. Highway, established 1910. Grand Marshals are Independence residents David and Gail Woodruff, who authored the book, Tales along El Camino Sierra. Day wraps up with fireworks uh, put on by the Independence Volunteer Fire Department at the airport. Urge you to see SierraWave.net for all the Independence Day weekend celebrations in Independence, including at the Winnedumma Winds Casino at the Fort Independence Travel Plaza. We have also posted the entire list of events that we have through the Mammoth Lakes Chamber of Commerce in the town of Mammoth Lakes. All sorts of fun to be had here in the Eastern Sierra. We hope everybody does, and we're going to be careful out there. We'll be back with a weather report.